All right. Wonderful people, Max Morning, everyone. Welcome to our Monday night mentorship call. I hope you are doing good. If you can hear me, let me see you type something on the comment section. Thank you all. Welcome, 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 guys. It's a beautiful Monday evening. Wonderful. All right. So I'm all always excited to have you all i hope you guys can hear me okay i hope you can hear me nice we are live we are live ladies and gentlemen max morning and welcome to our monday night mentorship call I am your host for today. My name is William Jima, and you can call me WAP Master. I'm your host for today. It is a phenomenal day. Today we have an unusual topic, um, not one of the topics that we really treat. So if you don't have your team members here, send them a quick message on the WhatsApp page. Tell them the Monday Night Mentorship Program has started. They should go to the website www.maxmentorship.com and they, they are going to see us. Okay. All right. So let's see who is here. Today we are going to do shabu shabu. I have so many things to talk about. We're going to do it quick, 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 shabu shabu, shabu shabu. I have a lot of things to talk about. But then if I'm not able to finish it all, we might have a part two of this. <laughs> it's a lot. Taking data analyzing it interpreting it it's a lot of job okay that's so much work in doing that thank you all for your feedback now let's do some introductions let's see who we have here all right let's see who we have here we have rory or um cornelius adetunji eugenia asari we have gladys Mwaukelemi. Uh, wow, sorry if I made out your name, okay. Seram Blazing, Eric Amosa, Michael Otu, Verafi, Nobo Amenuke, Roger Kwame from Abidjan. So, guys, type your name and where you are tuning in from. We have Travis from Tema, Arafat, Abdul Rashid, Irene. Samo Atta, Branson from Branson, Chris from Nuagbe. Okay, I assume that's in Ghana. Right, Righteous Rich from Kede, Emmanuel E from where? Okay, wow, the names are lots. Nati Bongo, Nathaniel Ramsin, uh, Abdul Rashid from, from Tamale. Okay, Rafis, Legon, Leave Max Morning, Porsche, Akachi. All right, I'm always excited to spend the evening with you all every Sunday and then. Uh, every Sunday for our BOM and the Monday uh, Monday night for our mentorship program and also the Friday night school. It's always amazing to see you guys and also to interact. Um, yesterday we had our uh, Max BOM. The playback is still available. You can refer your prospects to it, okay? Let me show you the link for the bom we had yesterday is www.maxbom.live as displayed on your screen all right so you can invite your team members or your prospects to go and see it to be available if they go there they are going to see it we talked about um, max presentation the income and the currencies from ghana cities nigerian um Naira, and also we talked about dollar for those who are not in in uh, Nigeria or Ghana, so that they can convert it from dollar 
to their currency. All right. Wonderful, wonderful. Wonderful. So let's see. All right. So guys, introduce yourselves. Let's start quick, 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 quick. Okay. Today it will be hot and quick. Willy Paco from Kumasi, Cornelius from Lagos, Nigeria, Nathaniel from Accra, Joel, Habiba, Takwa, Jeffrey Ashama, and Prince Asante Abokobi, Yadan Susunyani, Michael to Takrade, Pita from Takrade. All right, so guys, let's get started. Now, first of all, I want to find out how you are doing. How are you doing? How are you? How are you doing? How's your health? How are your parents? How are your siblings? How is your family? How are your team members? Okay, give me some feedback to in the comment section. Let me know because your health is also very important. As much as we need money, as much as we are building this business so that we can get money to be able to transform our lives and the lives of our family members and our loved ones, we also need money. We need money to get things going. Okay, so the, the world moves around because payment has to be done to a certain uh, to, to some corners. You need to do some things with money. Money will help you move. It's like a vehicle to take you to a lot of destinations and to your dreamland, okay? So guys, thank you very much. Um, those who are joining us a bit, like five minutes late, no problem. You are still welcome, welcome, welcome. All right, so today's own is very simple. We are going to talk about data, hmm? data, and action data and action now if i talk about data what do you mean what do you understand by data so someone might think that if i say data it means that internet data or data as in bundle okay so where i grew up where i come from that is what i thought data was so got to some point i realized data is actually statistics information that will help you analyze some things that will influence the decisions and actions you are going to make. So this information and the statistics will help you make calculations and reason better. That is data, that is data. So if, let me find out if I can get some internet definition for you. Um, data, data. Let me see, where's my phone? Oh, okay. Data. All right, so exactly as I'm saying, now, data uh, um, to be facts and statistics collected together, okay, for reference and analysis. So, the data you are going to collect, wherever you are going to collect the data from, it will help you make decisions and it will give you the basics for reasoning and calculation. So that is why I'm going to talk about um, data. It's also very, very important. This is not a normal training that we do here at Max International. If you are new here, you must know that at uh, mentorship programs and most of the training that your uplines have been doing, it's not always all about recruitment, prospecting, sell product, all those things. We do entrepreneurship development. We do mindset training. We do coaching on dressing, branding. We do everything. We even do trainings on IT. We do things, deep, deep things. Okay, so... If you can search this same channel after this training, you can subscribe and go to the playlist for Max, Max, Max Mentorship Program. You see that I have trainings like cyber security, savings, and is this some on regular trainings, trainings that you're not getting in another network marketing company. And let's Max International here. All right, guys, so data and analysis. I'll be breaking it into some sessions, okay? Um, like always, if, if I get through now, we are my talk a lot, so I try to list down some points. I have some small sheet of paper. Where is it? Okay. Okay, that's it. Let's set down some. So the what? The where? But before the where, we'll talk about who, and then where and then how, all right, and then why. So what is data? We've talked about what data is, okay? It's, it's, the, it's the facts and the statistics that you can collect to help you get together a lot of reasonings for you to be able to uh, move and act on it. 
Now, if you talk about data in our business, it can be information that you gather from prospects, information you gather from associates, information that you gather, you gather from um, 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 your customers, whatever information that you gather from these three, three, three groups of people that will help influence your decision is data. Okay, it's data. So sometimes you can gather data from prospects or your customers. They can be retail customers or preferred customers who have an idea with Max. It's still data or data you, got, you can gather from um, your team members. So, and there are a lot of places that you can gather these data from. So I'm going to, um, as I talk, I'll be jotting this thing down so that when I get so passionate, I don't go overboard because sometimes I get passionate, I'll be talking, I'll not even watch the time and then we will pass the one hour. So today I want to try and then squeeze in a lot of things so that we can be in our one hour, okay? I appreciate your time so much and I love you guys for spending time with, with us every Monday night. Okay, so now, who gathers this data? Who? The who, the who, the who, the who? Who gathers this data? Who gathers this data? You associates. Everybody here at Max International can gather data, whether they are ambassadors, staff, associate, preferred customer, whatever. Anybody in this life, so far as you can read, write, reason, think, that's all. You just have to be able to, to reason so that when you get data or you get an information, data is information that can help your reasoning or your calculation, that can influence your actions or some things that you are going to do. That's specifically it, okay? So that is it. Anyone, everyone should, act, should act, actually take data. Everyone, everyone should take data. Everyone should take data. Now, the next thing too is who do you take data from or data of, all right? It can be from or off. If you are calling a preferred customer to find out how they are doing on the product or how, the, the, um, um, how their weight management is or what results they are getting from the product, all of that is data. Let's say you are trying to put together a lot of testimonies from your 20 preferred customers. You send three of them. Three of them are on Switch, five of them are on CellGBT, two are on Meta, um, um, on um, 357, some are on GXL. So you have a list of all these people. Then you call the first group of people and find out how they are doing. Uh, do, you, do they have any testimonies to share? Do they have any pictures? Good, let me say this before I forget, okay? The world is changing, the world is transforming quickly as much as possible. If you get testimonies from your prospects or your customers, I mean, if the person is your brother or your sister and they say, oh, you can openly share, my brother, be very careful about it. Be very deliberate and conscious about it. If my customer sends me picture of um, their transformation, maybe they had some, um, um, they, they had some breakouts a lot on their face and then they've used Max product and it has cleared their face. And they, they are so excited. Same when they are in the moment, they are so excited. Oh, they, they, they'll send it to you. Wow, 357, oh, it has made my face smooth. Then they'll send you pictures and videos. Then you two excited associates. You two, you go and you ask the person. Sometimes you, you know even ask. Let's say you ask the person, so can I share this? Before? They say, yes, 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 you can share so that people come and buy their product from you. Then you to out of excitement, you put it on the max group. Let's say you put it on Tukumeso. Here, yeah? that is where things go, go viral. Because all the bronzes, major, like about 90% of the bronze and above that are actively building a business are there. Everybody has a very big team. So you put it there, boom, that's it. They want something to, to take. You put it there, boom. So you don't make mistakes in such groups. You put the testimony there and say, wow, three, five, seven. Then they share on their WhatsApp page. They share on their status. People share before you know it's on some websites. Then initially your prospect thought that, oh, this is just something small. Oh. The, he, he didn't actually think about how big this your max business is. He gave you his or her data. Then now it's everywhere. And then your prospect's girlfriend or their wife or their boyfriend will be sending them a message. Hey, I saw this on this person's status. Initially, to be cool, it's, wow, their friends will be sending a message. Hey, is that you? Is it true? I saw this on my friend's status. Yes, so, yes, so. Then you'll be there. Uh, someone you don't, the person, the, the customer doesn't like someone. Let's say the customer has an enemy, be that enemy to go and share on their status looking for customers. So the customer will be like, ah, this guy, I don't like this guy. And he's using my picture to now get sales. 
So then he'll call you that, hey, my picture grand, take it down, take it down. My brother, it's too late. <laughs> it's too, take it down, take it down, take it down, saying, it's gone. It's gone. Let me let me say something I said on the night school. There's nothing like delays. There's nothing like delays when it comes to the internet. Most of the things that are Googleable, the things that you can Google, is that Googleable? Is it is it an English? Anyway, most of the things that you can actually Google, eh? Most of the things you can Google, they are not on the internet. About sixteen percent of the things that are actually on the dark web are Googleable. Can you imagine many of the things that someone post something on Instagram, Facebook, on WhatsApp, all those things, they, they say, oh, I've deleted. Why is it that sometimes you put something on your status, you've deleted, but some of the Android users will be seeing it? <laughs> you deleted in the morning, you know, but some people are seeing and replying you. This, nothing gets deleted. I want you to understand this one. So whenever you are posting something, you need to be very conscious, deliberate, and intentional. You need to be very careful about it. You need to think about it critically. So... Right now, when I see someone sharing a testimony, sometimes to uh, some people share testimonies of some people in another country or, or, or some other company, they don't know. They just saw that someone has lost weight somewhere and they will Photoshop and put switch there. These things can cause problems. I've seen companies that have been sued, associated that have been sued by some other company because they sat in their room and designed something and put flyer that, let's say you, you, some, you don't know this specific person. Let's say, okay, right now, let's say me, okay, workmaster. I'm in Max International, I'm a Max Diamond Associate, okay? I'm building this business, I'm, I'm growing, and then I've been able to use MetaSwitch and, and I lost all my belly fat. I be, it became flat, okay? It became flat. Let's say I had a pot belly like this and it became flat and I took a picture, pot belly, and then six packs. Then I posted MetaSwitch. Good for you. I'm using this picture to promote my business. In my opinion, it's fine because I'm a leader. The majority of my team members will be sharing, so I'll not really be bothered. If someone says, even with that cry, sometimes we get bothered because it can end up somewhere that you don't like. Before you know it, it's in Kenya. My picture is in Kenya. They've removed their switch. They've removed Meta switch. They've photoshopped it out and they've put some product, some shakes and some product there that this is what this so-called guy used. Can you imagine? Do you know how I will feel? I can even take the company on. I can sue them with my lawyers. I hope you understand what I am talking about. So this is very, very important. These things can happen. So as much as possible, eh, if you are sharing a testimony, eh, and let's say the person had some breakouts, and let's say it's 357, it's this person's information, it's this data, it's very so. So you need to cover his eyes like this. Use something to cover his eyes. What do I even have to cover? Um, I want to use something to cover my eyes. Okay, let me use this scratch card. All right, so by, by the end of this training, I'll, I'll scratch these cards and then share it. So you use something like this to cover his eyes, okay? Let's say um, you make it like this. Too big though, but it has to be small. Maybe half, half like this and cover a person's eyes like this, okay? You just edit it, Photoshop, whatever, photo grid, only phone app can do it like this. You just cover something black, cover the person's eyes, okay? That's all, then you can share it. So no matter how it flies on the internet or trends, whatever, the person's identity is somehow protected because sometimes when the customers are excited and they are emotional about the product, they are happy in the mood, they are happy. But the time will come that they want the picture out of the internet and you might not be able to do anything about it. That is why when I see any, uh, any new testimony, I quickly send a person message, please delete it, let's edit it first. Sometimes if you don't put the max product there, if I see a poster, I ask the person, do you know this person? Says, yes, it's my sister, it's okay. Let's edit it. Cover her eyes and now put the product there because we have videos of Max International products, people that we knew. Even some of the videos, I shot it with my phone. I shot those videos, so, but you see it in another company and they are using this, their testimonies. It was DXL. The woman was very excited, dancing and all that. Then another company, because the woman didn't mention DXL in it, another company too used it. 
Okay, it happened to Dr. Jules too. She had to now use her lawyers. It's on that many, many companies' website. The woman was now angry that her things are outside. Now. The lawyers, they were now pulling those. They would message the website owner. Now, if you don't pull it down, we are finding you. Then they pull it down. People were cleaning their selectivity and they will put their company product there. And they will be promoting it. So this data that you get from customers is very, very important. And sometimes to screenshot. Screenshots, okay. The customer is so excited, they're giving you a screenshot. If you want to share, ask them first, okay? Ask them first. Let's say you are chatting with a team member, whoever, ask them first. Sometimes we made some of these mistakes, it's not nice. I have made those mistakes before. You want to share something, you don't tell the person, and you screenshot and you go and post, hey, um, 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 Mr. Gbezuke bought product last week, and then he's, he said he, he his, his stomach is now going down. Come on, he shared it with you. You didn't ask permission from him. Ask him, please, can I share this with my team members? Even with that, cover his phone number. Make sure his phone number is not showing anywhere or his full name is not showing or his proper picture is not showing. If you don't know how it's done, contact the next bronze upline, okay? If you don't know how it's done too and you want to learn, join the night school. We've been doing a lot of IT trainings and things that are not normal. Things that we don't do on normal, normal trainings like this, okay? It's very, very important. Very, very important. Now, I think I'm, I'm, if I don't take care, I'll go over this. Hey, only customers and I'm, I'm, I'm 20 minutes away like that, Charlie. I hope you guys are getting value from it. Good. Next one. Who do you get the data from? So the data can also be gotten from um, 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 prospects, your prospects, people that are yet to join you at Max International. So there's a difference between data from and data for. So data from customers are information, testimonies, feedbacks they've been giving you. Maybe your customer took the product. He says, oh, when I take the product before I eat, it's fine. But when I take it after I've eaten, it, it, sits in, it sits on my chest. I got that feedback from my customer. I also experienced it. So now when I'm selling salgibity to people, I tell them, you can take it when you are about to eat or before you eat so that the food will be on top of the salgibity. The salgibility will not be on top of the food. So many people, I know some of you who are watching this video or this training might um, have this experience, maybe from like one or two customers. They'll tell you, oh, the salgibility, when I take it, then my, my chest is burned, my heart, my heart is pumping. Poop, 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 poop. That's not the case. It's called dyspepsia. Maybe they took, you see, there's, there's black pepper in the salgibility. Or, okay, it's one of the antioxidants. It also helps many of the ingredients and the antioxidant to be absorbed. That is the job of it. But then, when you take it, when your stomach is full, the product will be sitting on your chest, and when the, 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 it's out of the, the capsule, and the black pepper comes on your chest small through your, maybe your sofa goes, you have that uncomfortable feeling. It's like people who have peptic ulcer. It, they'll have that uncomfortable feeling and all that. So it's advisable that they take the product when they are about to, or they can even... When they are eating, then they take the product. That's what I do. When I'm eating, then I'll take the salgivity. That's how it's done. So that the food will be on top of the product. Or you take it just when you are about to eat. But not when you are full. Some people will eat and they are full. Then they will drink more water. When they are full and they can't, nothing can go again, they now open the salgivity that they say I should eat well. So that then they will now take the salgivity is here. It's not going. It's not going. <laughs> we have discomfort too. So this is an information I got from my customer and I was able to use it very well, okay? I was I, I now added it to my trainings and I was telling people why you need to do that. So it was one time too, I was was, was on a Monday night mentorship call and it was a Q&A session and I got this same question that my someone said, my customer said when they take the surgivity, their chest is burning and hurting and they have stomach pains. I told them to change the way they take it and the next three days, the guy called that the customer is very happy that the customer is calling him a doctor. <laughs> so, guys, that is what we are. We are ribosome specialists. Some of this information that you get, write them down or consume it. Make sure it's in your head. Teach so that you'll be able to grab it well and you can duplicate that process, okay? So, some of these data, some of this information, it helps you to reason and calculate your movement so that it can influence your actions and your decisions in the Max International business, all right? It's very, very important. Now, the next one is um, data from, um, 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 from, so we've done data from customers. Now, data for customers. The data for customers, you can actually get it from your WhatsApp status. So data for customers means that 
you have a list of people that are potential customers, people that you think can buy your Max International product, okay? So you can have, as you put things on your status, on, and, and, and this is also very important. This thing is very important. Those of you who are not using the social media stories, you are losing it all. You are losing the, you are losing, like you are losing, it. you are missing it. You are missing the ish. You are missing it. Ask people who are posting on their status, their WhatsApp status, their Instagram stories, their Facebook stories. And right now, Facebook is owned by WhatsApp. Facebook has also bought Instagram. So all these things, these three have been synced together. Very soon they are going to merge it and things are going to happen. Ladies and gentlemen, technology is, is working in our favor. You can put something on your status and you can you can tap all the things that you have put on your status and automatically you share it on your Facebook um, story. Automatic, all of it will be just be pushed to your Facebook story so that those that you don't have their contact, they can still be seeing it. And then you can share them one, 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 one. That sharing on Instagram is quite tedious, but then on Instagram you can add some GIF and emojis and that's how Instagram is. Instagram is supposed to be fun. So it's not everything that you share there from your WhatsApp though, because some things you don't really want it to be out there. So you select the ones that you want it out there. And then Instagram too. I'm trying to turn this one into a social media training. <laughs> um, let me try not to. So let me just say this one and we end that part. So that not. So on Instagram too, okay, all the things that you have shared on your story on Instagram too, you can add it as highlights on your profile so that when, when someone goes to your profile, they will see it. Now, let me show you um, Instagram. Okay. Let me tell you what I'm talking about so that you not think that it's just mouth, 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 mouth that we are talking. Wonderful. So, good. Let me show you. I hope we are together. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. Now, uh, application window. Good, Instagram. Good. So, as you can see here, okay, this is my Instagram feed. So, those who don't know, this is the feed. Everything you see here will be your friends, people that are your friends. They will be the people that you have followed. And sometimes the things that you have posted and the things that people have posted. So this guy posted a video of yesterday's BOM, an extract of it. So that is the people that you are following. You all be showed here. And it's very important that you, you select who you, you follow because all these things give you data. They feed your head, okay? So this is your profile. You go to your profile. If you click on your profile to open like this, okay, and your profile have to have a team. Later, I'll do a training. So, and you come to my profile like this, it has a yellow team, something like that, okay. That is it. Some people to have another team. So, I'll show you another guy's team. Own it's it's. So, let's say um, let me go back to the home page. So, you know these these things here, these small small things that you see here, they are the stories, okay. They are the stories and they are people that I am following. So let's say if it's Gary V, you click on this round thing and Gary V's story will pop up. Story are just short, short videos. You see, short, short videos. Instagram can take 15 seconds, 15 seconds. And these ones, is this story thing, it's proven to be able to help you get sales. You, can't, you will not believe if I told you the number of team leaders who are getting product sales. I know people who are getting product sales like every month, 30 bottles. Serious, you can add, ask Bernardo. Bernardo and Ano Jambibi and Verafi, they are making sales because of this. People are joining because of it. Sometimes you don't have to enter people's DMO. This story is thin now, and it's not just one day you post and you get the, the, the thing. You need to be consistent with the data you are feeding them. Okay? You need to be very consistent. So these are the things. So you go to the person's profile, you see it there. And now when you click on your my profile to you see the story that I said there, this was a BOM. I said another person's Dr. Joseph's story. Then you see another person also shared the uh, Verafi tag me. I said, then my own one. You see, the way it is you now, you just modify it a little so that it will catch attention. The same video, one video pair I shared though, but to catch attention like this with all these things. So you can add it. Then if it's product you are sharing, whatever you are sharing. This one is a video about network marketing. When people have a network marketing, that it's a scam, all those things. 
Okay, it's very, very, very important. It's very, very important. Very, very important. So stories, you can make sales. You put product there, testimonies. All those things, you can post it on your story. That is the data you are feeding to your Instagram. Book. But when it's your account, when you come to your account, this is not where you put the products. It's not where you put products and people's faces and testimonies. So no, it's the, put, don't put it at the feed. Your feed has to be your face. You see people, you scroll on someone's uh, Instagram, uh, you will never see his face there. You will never see his picture. Nothing. It's just celebrity. GSL. No, it doesn't have to be here. It has to be on your story. And when you come to the story, you can actually do the highlights like this, okay? You can put it in highlights like this. So this one, if you come to health and wealth, that is where my highlight for the health and wealth is. So if I open it, it's just product, product, product. You see? Product, product, testimonies, 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 testimonies. Everything product is there. Product, product, product. So that is how you, you do it. The same applies to WhatsApp and Facebook. The stories are good, okay? Don't let me turn this into a social media training, all right? Let just use this one as a small um, version of, of, of it. This this thing, I've gotten sales of, from this one, raw of sales. You see this one? It's just, you have only one body. Make sure you, you clean and take care of it. The most expensive gift you have from God is, in this life, is the body. See, so... Product, 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 product. So when the first container product arrive, all those things, you know, just share the excitement. When you see the things on the page, share it too. It's very, very important. All right, so now let's move. Okay. Um, yes, the team to, let me go. I nearly turned this thing to a social media training. We will do social media training later, not, not now. <laughs> All right, good. So guys, I hope you get my point on the, the information you feed on the internet, okay? So you, it's very important that if the customer doesn't want their face, let's, if it's a new person, if a new associate, ask them, well, do you really want your picture out there or I should just cover the iPad? It's fine. They, they, it can be switched, okay? Their body can be showing. You can cut off the head or people might doubt. So you show the head but cover the iPad. This side, if you cover it, that's all low. People might not recognize who it is. Even if it trends and goes viral. Now these days, things go viral easily. Oh. Things go viral easily. And the other thing, let me say this before I forget, okay? I, 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 I wanted to say it on the night school last Friday. I forgot it. See, guys, we need to be very careful of what we post. That is, you see, sometimes eh, I'll be sharing 10 years ago, things that I posted, seven years ago, things that I posted. Because all those things, I was dreaming big. Sometimes, eh, those, those days, I, I didn't even know what I was talking about. I was still posting and sharing it. The data you put out there on the internet is very, very important, too. There was this guy that he got a job at Microsoft, okay? He got a job, but that same day, they sacked him because of a tweet he made on Twitter 10 years ago. Just something he posted on Twitter 10 years ago made him lose his job. The same day, some people have been denied. They go to interview and they do a background search and they find out something they've posted before and they've deleted. Oh, <laughs> So don't say, say, oh, I've deleted, I've cleared all my... Master, don't, don't post it. If you are posting anything before you post something, ask yourself, is it worth it? Is this the best of me? Is this the best I can do before you push send or post? You need to be very, very conscious about it, okay? <laughs> now let's move to the main thing that we are talking about today. Um, that's why I had to jot this these points down so that or not. So now we are where we are still on the on the who. Okay, so who you get the data from from customers? The, the, the data you get from customers, uh, there are testimonies. They are um, um, the testimonies can be written testimonies, screenshots, their pictures, or their lab results. I've had customers. The HIV customers, they send their lab results to you. You see the CD4 count has really decreased. Not like their HIV or their ACE is gone, no, but the, the, the CD4 count has changed. So means changing means that their health has improved. And some of them even think that oh, the, the HIV is gone. But you can't say that it's gone. Our product is not curing anything, okay? <laughs> All right. So that's the data you get from the, the, uh, the, the customers. Now... The data for customers, it's 
when you put information out there on your status, everything, and those who see, those who comment, let's say you promoted a, an ad or a picture or a celebrity video, whatever, and those who come to like and comment, they are not your team members or your customers already. They are data for customers, okay? Not data from. From are the ones you get from your already customers or people's customers. Data for customers are people that are potential customers. Same applies to the prospects. Data from prospects are what your friends think about Max before they join Max. So that to help you be able to solve other people's objections. So your friend, one of your prospects said, eh, this Max, they said when you join now, uh, you get money. That's why I don't want to join. I think it's, it's Juju or it's, it's, it's not a real business. That's why they said when you join now, uh, you'll be rich. Then you tell him, my guy, it's not like that too. If, if it's like that, won't I be rich? Maybe you are one, one year old or two years or maybe one month old and he's saying that you are trying to tell a friend and he said you'll be rich one week. Like, what, who does that? We are trying to what? We are selling a product, we are promoting a business and we are building a brand with it. We are building a distribution network with Max International products. So that's what we are doing. We are not joining Max and we sit there and, and make our finger and Max International will pay us. It's not like that. So this data that you got from your team, this information, this intel that you got from your, 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 your prospect helped you to be able to what, solve other people's objections. So it will give you that information. There's so many information that you can get from customers and prospects, okay? I don't want to go too deep into those ones, but you can get so much from customers. Let's 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 utilize on it. It's very very important. All right. So then the next one, okay. Good. Now for prospects, data for prospects, okay. Data for prospects. Now anything that you do to help you build your list is the data for prospects. Data for prospect. Anything you do that will help you get more people. You go to an online event, you connect with people. There's an entrepreneurship Zoom free seminar be happening somewhere. You connect with them, you exchange contacts. There's a party with, with of course, social distancing and all those things. They wear your marks and you exchange phone numbers and you come back and work on it. You don't go and talk about Max Day. People are partying and drinking champagne. Uh, uh, What's, what's the trending song cry? They'll be dancing, they'll be dancing. Then you two, you are there. So Max International Putu, and then this master. That is not a time that you talk about business. Party, have fun, exchange contacts with them, come back home and work on the contact. Find out what they need. When you are able to find their need, then you'll be able to know, let them know how Max International can fit into that need. Okay? So that's exactly what you do. That is the data for customers. You do every uh, for prospects. You do everything you can to grow your lists. You're posting well. You're branding on Facebook, social media, everywhere. You'll be branding it well. You'll be posting nice. All those things. It's very, very important. Critical. All right? Good. Then the next thing is um, data from your team members. When you're done with the from, you go to for. Okay? So data from your team members. What are some of the information you get? from your team members imagine some of the questions i ask you guys when we are on a call or when we are on the ninth school sometimes i ask at the ninth school that um tell me what you guys want what you guys want me to do for you what are some of the trainings that i need to talk about sometimes i call some of the leaders platinums goals diamonds and i ask them what are some of the challenges that you have in your team so when i'm able to get a, 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 the same problem happening in the in a specific month then i'll do a training on it okay that is how we move you get that data from, so let's say you're a senior associate, you have like three or four or five team members, and you call all of them and find out how they are doing, they are not able, what, what, what is their problem, what are they lacking, they say, hmm, they, they don't know how to sell their product, or someone says, that they understand a pay plan, someone says, this, someone said, that. so at the end of the day, you realize that they've given you what they need, then you come and sit down and draft a plan with your team leader. Your team members said they don't understand authorship, they don't understand how to end in the business, and they don't understand how to sell the product. So you do a conference call with your team leader with these five people. Or first, you do a training on WhatsApp. So you see, the data you got from them have been able to help you think and make calculations and actions. So data that can make you make moves, not just any data. Not just any data. It's very, very important. All right? <laughs> You guys are blasting. Wow. 
Is it advisable to share testimonies in the comment section of someone's post? Someone has posted something and you go and share. Those things are spamming. You. It's, it's spamming. You, it's, you're, sometimes the person can even block you. They've said your beautiful photo and you go and share that. If you want to wait us, pro that, contact me. If, if they don't like you, they'll just block you. And that's it for you. You can't say that. And what if, you, if 10 people or 20 people or 50 people block you at a time on Instagram, it will send a red alert to Instagram. And they might look into your account and block it. Before you know, you don't have your account again. So the last thing you want to do on Instagram and Facebook and actually social media is spamming. Spamming is sending people things they don't ask for. Hmm? So spamming is not any big word that you, you might not understand. It simply means you are sending things to people that they don't ask for. The people have not asked you for something, you are sending it to them. You send their inbox, you send them videos, presentation. They've not sent, they've not asked you for any link. Then you send them link, click here to join ABM, click here to, no, 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 no. They will not do that. If you want to understand this better, look for my training on permissive marketing, okay? To help you get this, it's, it's, it's in the same channel. Okay, so look for the channel. When we are done with this presentation, of course, <laughs> then you can go there and then look at the playlist and then you can get that training. If you have not subscribed to, please subscribe. We are growing this channel to be able to bring you content all the time. So we need your support. Like it so that you'll be able to be showed to more associates who come on this platform. We want people to get content when they join our business so that things, you see, the training that we've done, I started doing conference calls way back 2015, you know, but all this information, when we are done, we put it on WhatsApp and they get lost. Our clients will still be asking you a month later. Even the next day, after you put it on WhatsApp, someone will still be asking you, please send me the, the, the conference call. But it's on the page. You see, but here it's just on this link. Everything is there. You can just find it, okay? It's very, very important. Good. So now data from team members will be able to help you make moves. You get the data and the information from your team members, then you can now um, come up with a nice and beautiful way of uh, um, solving that problem. So let's say your team members give you this information. You call five, and maybe you're a bronze associate. You see that your team, it's like it wants to move. It's not, it doesn't want to move. People are getting cold and all that. Or they are not typing on your group. Then you call them one by one, one by one, especially the, the, the active ones. Then you find out how things are going for them. What do they want you to do for them? And why are they not typing on the page? And you start writing, you just pull a sheet of paper. That is my sheet of paper. Put a, pull a clean sheet of paper like this and start writing from the top to down what they want. That's it. Upon no, 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 that's the filler. You didn't pay any money for it. They've showed you how to be a better leader, how to guide them, and how to be successful. They said, boss, the time that you post on the group is too late, 12 a.m. We are asleep. My wife was angry when he, he, she saw that you are posting 12 a.m. It's a baby group. They have not grown and matured to be able to chew bones at that time. So be very careful. Then you write, don't post in group after 10 p.m. See, a pop, the person has given this, this it, it, intel. Then you ask the next person, so why is it that the group is dull and all that? And says, when you put the information, the, the, it is too much. You don't wait for us to comment. You say, okay, so when I'm typing, I need to wait, and then I need to mention their name. I need to wait and, and let them comment. I need to see who I've seen it. Good, good, good. And you see, number two. And number three, another person will say, boss, when you are sharing the video, you don't say anything about it. So we are thinking this video, do I have it already or I don't have it already? And people are saving their data, okay? You know this? These baby associate people who have joined Max, they don't really appreciate the information we put on the group. They are now growing to understand the importance, the importance of what we put on the page. So when you put anything there, they, they, are, they are thinking, is it the same thing that he posted yesterday? Should I download? Or should I, is it a funny video? Oh, they, they don't know. They will not appreciate it. But when you come to this Max International, everything on the page, it's a past question that can help you become successful. But they don't know yet. So they get there. So when you post a video, write the caption under it, okay? Write the caption under it. Wow, a nice entrepreneur move, uh, video. Or how to think big. Or how to do this. Or if you put the link there, don't just put the link there. Say, please join the BUM. And you, you ask another person. That's also very important. You ask another person, so what's, why is it that you, the team members are very cold to me and they don't understand when I call and they don't pick, it's a boss. The way you talk to us, no. 
Me, I'm being frank. I'm, today, I want to be brutally honest. You don't talk well on the group. And you're like, ah, it is not voice. It, I'm typing. How don't I talk well on the group? They say, you, you put things anyhow. You don't say please. <laughs> hey, the thing about communicating on WhatsApp, eh, the, the information is in your head. The data is in your head. You are putting it out there. So the people reading will read it in their mood. And they were really thinking about who you are. So let's say you put there, join the call now. Maybe you you were typing it as join the call now. The mass mentorship call has started. Join now. That's how you typed. You were smiling. But then someone in the group who is not in a good mood, who doesn't like you be reading, the call has started. Join now. <laughs> This guy, he, he he doesn't he doesn't respect like that. Is it by force to join the call? I'll not join. Are they? Uh, by force and uh, the call and I'll not join. What call is it? Cry. What again are they going to say? You see, they will not appreciate it. But persuasive communication, critically thinking about it, just right. Please let's all join the call. You just add it, please, and let's. That's all. Though. Let's all join the call now. Or just right. Join the call now, guys, or please join the call now. Then you add a smiley. Sometimes you post max morning on the group, you have to add a flower. Sometimes when you put fire fire on the group, like a baby associate, people who are new, they don't know hey, why are people pumping hearts. Hey, someone will just leave the group because the pumping heart is too much. It's too much. Pumping heart. Hey, he just joined the group. They said, Tia Robert, Tia Robert, Tia Robert, Tia Robert. Hey, what is Tia Robert? What is all this? Hey, guys, what is all this? They, they, ah, they don't understand. What is happening in this group? Ah, before you know, Mr. Bezuke has left. Tia Robert, what's the meaning of you? When you started saying Tia Robert, did you explain what Tia Robert means? Eh? <laughs> And then you'll, you'll be hearing boom, boom, boom. Attend the boom, attend the boom. What is this boom? So one day, just write B O M means that business opportunity meeting. You see, just get the information. So that's why when, when we are training, and sometimes the things we say is information that we get from our team members so that we'll be able to uh, twist some of the things that we have to say. Because sometimes, and the way I want to say some things, I have to, because I'm working with humans, we are all emotional beings. If you say things like the way it's in your head directly to your team members, it will hurt their feeling. But you, they, to you, there is just data you are giving them. <laughs> it has hurt them. <laughs> okay, it's very, very important that you know how to deliver this information that's in your head to your prospect, to your team members, and to everyone. Now, you know how to get the data from your team members, okay? Now, what about data for your team members? Where do you get it? First thing first. Now, you can get the data for your team members from your back office. Back office. And the second is your WhatsApp group. Okay? Your WhatsApp group. I'll talk about the back office last because that one it entails a lot and all that. Okay? So, the back office will be the last. Then the, the next one is the WhatsApp group and that's where you have most of your team members there. So, how do you see which of your team members are quite attentive, they are listening? So you go on your WhatsApp group right now, and the last post you made in the last five hours, who are the people that have been commenting, reacting, and the numbers that you have saved? Check their WhatsApp status. Who are they that are sharing the posters? Who are they that are sharing the products? Who are the ones that are sharing the business? Who are the ones that are sharing the opportunity? Who are posting motivation? Who are those that are posting this? You see, those are the people that you need to be monitoring. If you have saved their number, and then you think someone says he's serious, he's serious, but one month, two months, you are not seeing anything on his status. Ask him, um, I've not seen anything on your status before. He say, oh, what is status? That's when you sit down quietly. Breathe in and breathe out, and you teach them what the meaning of status. I had to sit down with a bronze associate because he didn't know how to put something on his WhatsApp status. I told him about status that he should put certain things on his status. So when there's something, a product testimony, he'll send it to me. 
and he sent it to all his contacts. He followed, 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 followed five people each every time, five, five, five. And I asked him, why did he, does he keep sending it to me? He said, oh, so that people will see. And I told him that he should, when you see something stay tossed, like, he said that he didn't understand what they said. He think there's some, some settings. He didn't want to go and cause any problem there. So, see, yeah, it's one that, it, it, <laughs> to surprise you, some few things that you think that maybe it's easy for you, people don't really know how to go around it all. Hmm? People don't know how to go around it. That's why some of the things that I teach on the ninth school, I know that some of you guys will know how to do it then, but still, I still teach. Like removing background, how to check the speed of your internet, all those ones, how to be able to align yourself with the, 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 the trends in this world, all those ones. It's, it's very, very important. All right? Wonderful. Hey, someone wants to look sharp and sell switch in the comment section. Charlie, you guys, the Wallahi, I love you. Business minded. <laughs> Max International. All right. So on your WhatsApp page, you monitor those who are reacting, those who are commenting, those who are doing things on the WhatsApp page. Those are the ones that are showing some commitment. If they are not doing, doesn't mean they are not serious. So it means they don't know how to do it. Some people too, they are waiting and hoping and praying that their upline will start commenting first. They, they, they just they were just added a week ago and their upline bronze has not commented on the page. So they are also waiting that maybe it's not their time yet. Or this group, people don't talk when they are just one month old. He doesn't know. So you have to always educate, educate, educate. Okay. It's very important. <laughs> now, Max International products are like okay. Charlie, when the product hit the ground, three hours later, people have come for it all. <laughs> right now, when I hear that the thing is at the airport, I'll give you guys hints. You know, we all come and wait at the, or, or the, at the, the Max office and do the order scrap before they send it to the regional offices. <laughs> yeah, you what? All right, guys. So, before the end of this um, I'm training, I'm going to show the. Um, the league table, okay. So there has been some overtaking in the in the league table. A lady has come to overtake last last four days. I showed you at the night school there was someone who had already signed ten. A lady has done overtaking. What? Max International. <laughs> overtaking is allowed here. So there's an overtaking and all that. So we will see. You will see here. Just ten days into the August promo. <laughs> Okay, so now you can also get data for your team members in their, in their DMs, okay? So let's say you can, one of the things that can also help you is you, the bronze or the silver associate, you can design a flyer with your picture on it or with your team name. So let's say Mr. Agbozuke's team name is um, Max International Team, okay? So Max International Team, Mr. Agbozuke. Bronze Associates. Please, if you need help under the, the same poster, please, if you need help in how to sell your product, contact me. I'll help you know how to sell. If you know you want to know how to earn this $250, contact me. If you want to learn how to make signups, contact me. You see, you put it on your page at, at least er, twice every week. You put it there consistently. They said that where a blacksmith hit, bang, 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 that's the most important thing. They may be a a blacksmith, I think that yes, you watch and change a whole thing. So keep hitting there. They said this is a direct translation. Let me say this. They said um, if you urinate at one particular point, it will ladder. Okay, it will form a, a foam. And it's true, it's a, it's a phenomenon when you are when you put water at a particular point. Uh, or when you are peeing at a particular point, I to form foam and all that. That's the same thing with the streams. When the water keeps hitting at a particular point on the rock for a long time, consistently, a day will come that the rock will start dividing to give way for the stream or that water, okay? So that is the power of consistency. It's very, very, very important. Very, very important. So you need to put it there in the information. It can be right up. You don't know how to design, it's fine. Can be right up. Then you put it there. Please, if you want to learn how to sell your product, contact me. I'm the I'm the leader on this page. I'll I'll teach you how to sell your product. I'll teach you this. And we need to also be um, uh, very loyal and, and credible to our team. Don't take someone's product that you want to sell it to them 
and later the money, things will be bad. You don't collect people's products to sell for them. You teach them how to do it. Okay? If you sell them for them now, will you keep selling till they hit crown diamond? No. You need to teach them so that they'll be able to do it. It's very, very, very important. The other thing too is um, when you're doing the sermons on your group, check who is commenting, who is like, who are the ones. They are the ones that are actively building their business. At least some, if, if you post post on your group and two days, some people have seen it and they have still not commented. Then there's a problem. Maybe their phone, they, they cannot type or their keyboard is not working or they don't want to type or they don't really value the information or they didn't understand the promo. A promo like this, big promo, mass international promo, we are left with 15 days to end the promotion. Then $250, you talked about it and some people came to see, made noise, but some people came to see, they didn't understand, so they just go and pass. You need to contact them and work with the people who have seen and are excited and show them how to end. You need to also talk about the promo on your page that please, if you want to learn how to end on this promo, send me a message. This is my number, 020 Post it. Do you understand? So you can also be calling your team members to get some information from them. So it can be from DM, sending them DMs, the call, the, the, the comments on the team and all that. And then you can do the flyer and post your picture or text it that um, please, I'm the team leader on this WhatsApp group. If you need any help, any intellectual support, let me know <laughs> so that they will not contact you for loans, okay? <laughs> it's very important. The other thing to, um, maybe I might have forgotten to talk about it is um, when you are prospecting, okay? How you get the information from the prospects, it can be from your WhatsApp status, I've said all those things, and then you can, sometimes you can, ask some q a things on your status story facebook or instagram stories okay you can ask those q a things on on those stories and like pick something that you want help with weight loss living well having a good life traveling around the world for free and joining a network of people and then getting paid every 15 choose something that you want help with so that i can help you so you post all these things and someone will comment, hey, I want to get paid on 15th Then you call them, you share exchange contact. You see, those Q&A sessions helped you to be able to connect with the people. Do you understand? So sometimes those ones too are important. And you, when you post something and those that come to comment and like, it's an internet, the Facebook has given you data of these people, okay? One thing you have to also realize is that the Facebook, the social media, it's a rented platform. There are a lot of platforms. There are three main platforms, rented platform, hybrid platform, and then owned platform. Rented platform, you don't build your house on a rented land. Rented platform, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. You don't go and build a large community there without moving them to your contact list. You can go and get one million likes. You post a video, one million views. But who are they? Who saw it? You don't know. Do you understand? You need to be able to get people who are interested into your pro in your product, in your business. You connect with them, get their numbers so that you can save it. Then you move to a hybrid platform like Telegram or WhatsApp. That one, you can be contacting them, you can be calling them. And when you have their contact or their email, that is the owned platform. You can do whatever you want to do anytime because you, if Instagram, if they, someone hacks your account, whatever, you still have the contacts, you still have the email. Imagine you have one million followers 100 million views or whatever, and then you are not being able to open your account again. What do you think will happen? It's a bad news. So you need to try and move people from the rented platform to the hybrid and then to the owned platform where you have their contacts so that they can't say, oh my, they couldn't open their Instagram again. That's why they were not able to contact you again. You have their contacts. You can chat with them anytime and anywhere, all right? Good. Okay. Also, you can get the data of people from referrals. So you have a customer, let the customer give you names and numbers of people in their age category who would like to also use Max International product to benefit from it. And you can get this information from them too. And when you get the information from them, you'll be able to add all these people to your customer base. You can let the preferred customer sign all of them. If you give them a deal, okay? I told one of my preferred customers that if she's able to get three of her friends to buy one product every month, she'll get a free product every month at a small tax. And that's the family and friends program. She was excited about it. 
she only pay like, like about 40 CDs or 45 for a free box of selectivity every month. That's all. Because she has three friends who are buying, and you, the associate, will be paid on all the four people when they are buying. You see that thing? So you just have to give them a deal, and they'll give you a referral. That's how it is. And as it goes on, you now tell them that this thing that you are doing, it's a part-time business. You don't know any young girl, anybody in their life who is open, who has options open for a part-time business. They'll say, oh, yeah, my son just graduated. He's jobless. Let me connect you with him. You see? They gave you leads, contracts. And be able to add all these ones to your database of prospects to be able to work on them. It's very important. Now, to wrap it up with data collection on the back office for your team members. This one, it is deep. Okay, the ones I've already talked about, it's it's an in-depth training that one day I'll love to dissect and go into it well and maybe prepare slides for it. And I know you are going to enjoy it. And I know that this one too, you have enjoyed it. So I'll try and wrap up with the data collection on the back office, okay? So first thing first, okay? Uh, let me write this before I go away. I want to just write some things down so that I will be focused on what I'll talk about. Good, so when you open your back office, when you open your back office, first things first, if you want to take data, you need to understand how the back office is designed, the orientation. By the way, there's going to be an update of the Max International back office, okay? It's nice. This one, how would you feel if, let's say, you sign someone in some country and they can get paid without hustle? Anytime they want, Wednesday they get paid in, the, and, and if they want to make payment to Max International for product, they just use their visa card. Transfer. How would you feel? That's where we are moving towards, okay? I know that you are alive on it. That is what is going to open the floodgates. <laughs> I call it global domination, ladies and gentlemen. Max International, baby. I know I don't have to spoil it for you, but big things are coming. Okay, this is just the tip of the iceberg. The company is working so hard to get a lot of things working for us very soon. When people sign up, you know, struggle with, hey, commissions, how do I send the money? Western Union, you know, then you go and join Q1 before you join the money, convert it from dollars. Long, long stories. All these things are going to be over. Hmm? All these things are going to be over very, very, very soon. Very, very soon. So, guys, I'm excited to tell you. But then again, now, for now, you need to understand the way the virtual office is and your goal, okay? And then one of the things that... You need to consider when you are taking data from your back office is that, um, okay, I like the comments. Yes, no size. Yeah, business just got better, guys. Business just got better. Yes, someone is saying, would you consider Messenger as a hybrid platform? Not really. But they are going to merge Messenger and WhatsApp very soon. So maybe. I hope you are getting value from this training as much as possible. Every time I try to bring you the best and I try to summarize these things so that you can get more value as much as possible. All right, all right. There's global domination coming. We'll be traveling like, like, <laughs> Before you know, what master is in Ouagadougou. Before you know, I'm in Cameroon. Before you know, I'm in Senegal. Before you know, I'm in here. Because that time, no, payments are going on. People are saying that we don't need the hustle and the payment and the commission and saying and say All those barriers are going to be re removed and then things will be smooth, 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 smooth. See, COVID-19 is happening, though. No. But Max International said COVID-19 is not happening to us. It is happening for us because of that. So, the product will still bring the product, even though there's a delay, one or one, one, one or two products will be shortage and all that. But there's demand, and the company is still producing the products and shipping and manufacturing, even though the workload, the, the workforce, the people, the, 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 the human resource, everything has decreased though. Because of, you see, USA is where the company is, and a lot of things are happening. There was reality, there was um, this Black Lives Matter thing, and all those things, you no. Know? Earthquake, earth, earth tremors happening, some uh, uh, hurricane happening elsewhere. 
All those things were happening. Even the, the, the state that Max International was, their the offices, you know, there was an earthquake. All these things are happening, but the company is still adjusting and help us move, irrespective of all that is happening in this world. So let's be grateful, guys. Let's be grateful. I have to tell you a secret. You know the secret, a secret that many people are not telling you. Secret is that the future is bright. Guys, the future is bright. All right, let's move on. Let's move on. Let's move on. It's getting big. It's getting big. COVID-19 got nothing on Max, baby. <laughs> let's move on. Now, what is your goal? Now, um, what I will break these things into some parts, okay? Taking data from your back office, I'll break it into sections. First part is that the time that you take the data. So I'll categorize them, right? First week, second week, after 15th of the month, before end of the month, and then last day of the month, and then something that I call the crossover time. Okay, and I'll tell you about it. What data you can take at the crossover time and how you do it. Okay, so this information, the, the back office thing I'm going to talk about here, it's going to benefit those who are senior associates and above, at least those who have made enrollment in a business. This will make sense, okay? And for those who know that they are building their business and a day will come, they'll be able to sign a two or three or five and they can get 10, 20, 100, and thousands of people in their team. This will be of so much value to you, okay? All right. So first, the first week of the month, what is the data that you can get from the back office? First week of the month. I know a lot of you guys are already doing it, gold, platinums, and above, and all that. And then um, if anyone wants to... I'll, I'll, post, I'll put an email on the screen just after the training so that if anyone needs help, that's if you are silver and above and you need help to get your team data, any of the team data that I talked about, okay? Any of the team data, if you need help on how to extract it, how to extract it, let me know. We can do that and send it to you, silver and above only. And then most of the gold associates, you can at least contact your gold or platinum or diamond leader. They'll be able to help you. Yes, that's the, that's the best thing. Contact the, the next gold or silver upline or the diamond leader that is in your team. They'll be able to help extract your team data, the ones that I'm going to talk about. And then you can have a discussion with them how you can interpret this to draft a course of action. It will really, really help. This side of my presentation, it's very important to me. Let me increase my volume here. This is very, very important to me. So I need to make sure you guys are hearing me. I, I hope you guys are hearing me. This side is very, very important. I hope you'll be able to get what I'm saying. All right, cool, that's fine. All right, so first week of the month, first week of the month, the beginning of the month is a very critical month, at a very, very, very critical time of the month. Now, if you've been watching my trainings, I talk about what you have to do in the month. Most of your leaders, platinum, diamonds, and above have all be, also been training on what exactly you need to do in the beginning of the month. So add all those things to what I'm saying. So this is not just the only thing you do in the beginning of the month, okay? So let's say first day of the month, sit down very quietly, assess your team, take inventory. This is one of the things I learned from our Crown Diamond Mentor, Christian Jengas and Camisellas. He told me that about taking inventory. So at the end of every month, I give them statistics and data of my team, how many people joined, how many bronzos, how many silvers, what are the challenges we've had, how many BOMs have been able to do, trainings have been able to do, what's some problems that we are having on our team, then they can advise me on a training that I, I should do for my team members and what I need to also do. Do you understand? So that is exactly what I'm trying to say here. Sit down quietly, assess your team, take the, the statistics, find out, hmm? first things first, how many of your team members were active last month, okay? So you take data of all those that were active, all those that had PV. Before then, you would have taken it in the crossover time. So I'll skip this one. This data is best taken at the crossover time. You understand why I'm saying it's crossover time. So first week, you now 
sit down quietly and use data from the crossover to draft a team promotion and then a team activities. So if you want to, let's say someone contacts, oh, I want to work with you. I don't have any bronze or silver or gold leader that is still in the business. So I want to work with you. Then I say, okay, no problem. No problem. You need to get your team activities. What are your activities this month? What do you want to do this month? What be, how many BUMs, conference calls? What are the problems you had in your team last month so that we can have a course of action? Do you understand? It's very, very, very important. Oh, Charlie, the things I want to talk about is a lot too, but time check, eh? <laughs> it's not easy. Good. Now, that is the first week of the month. You use the data you got from the crossover night to now draft an action plan. Sometimes too, it's better when you draft the action plan for the, the next month and month before or a day before. So you can plan for September in August so that you'll be able to know what is happening, things that are happening last day of September, August, as you are ending the month, you are also planning for next month. But then if you didn't do it, the first day of the new month is the first time. So you find out all the people that were able to hit rank, those who were able to join your team, the new associates you had, everything. You draft it all. You can get all that information on, on the back office. A day, I'll take a day so that we really go into the back office to navigate I'll try and get an account from someone who is not really known by you guys so that you not see volumes and, and his commissions and then be saying this guy is earning this and all that. So I'll try and get an ID, maybe an NIT person or something like that. If suffice, you can log in and he doesn't really have team members that are still popping up for you to see them, okay? So that it will not be bad or to hurt people's feelings that you showed my uplines account and then I was showing in it and people saw my pay leg and all that. So you will not use that. So one day I'll find a way to go deeply into those trainings. Okay. So that you know how to extract them to send it to Microsoft, either Word, PowerPoint, PDF, whatever. Like the way I've been doing for you to see the 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 the, the promotion, the winners and all those things. You know, okay. And mostly too I've been doing it on a Friday night school on Zoom. The meeting ID is Max Pace on Zoom. Just directly you'll be able to join with video, audio, ask questions, and, and all that. And our Monday night mentorship call, you already know how to join it. Okay. It's maxmentorship.com. That's all. And then you are in. And then if it's a BUM, it's Max B O M. B O M B like bread. O like opportunity. So it's Max Business Opportunity, but it's Max B O M. Max Business Opportunity Meeting, maxbom.life. If it's happening, you know. If it's not happening, you still see the playback till the next one is up. Then that one will go, and then the next one will also be, be there, but it will still be available for playback. It's still in this session, this training session, guys. So then the second week of the month, you now see the progress. You track the progress from last week of the month. How many people were able to auto-ship early in your team? First week, first day to the second day of the month, how many people were able to auto ship? So now you'll be able to know what exactly is wrong with your team. Is it that your team members are late auto shippers? They don't auto ship early, or what exactly is happening in your team? You'll be able to get all that information so that you can act on it. Okay, it's very important. That's the information you get on the second week of the month data. You write. You check your team, how many people are active by now? So let's say we are in the second week of the month. You go to your team and check all the active people. You sort out and, and take out the new people from it. How many people are old associates but are active now? If it's less than what you thought it should be, then it means that you need to do auto ship promotions, okay? Things that will promote early auto ship, things that will ginger people to auto ship early. So the data you got from the back office from your team is now helping you to be able to draft activity and a course of action to help your team. Now, if you check your team and in the first one week, you saw only a team of maybe 50 people, you're a bronze or silver associate, and only two people have joined you in the last 10 days in August. Two new team members, pay the whole of your team. Then it means that there's an enrollment problem. Enrollment is a problem. So you need to do what? Enrollment-driven promotions. Promotion that will promote that will that that will motivate people to what make enrollment. That is uh, one of the examples that Max International is doing the dollar promotion. Okay, 
say fifty dollar, your team members are not doing the fifty, twenty, hundred dollars, and the two fifty dollars. They are not doing ten for two fifty dollars and above. Then you need to educate them. A man who knows what is there to be won will do whatever it takes to get it. Sometimes some people don't know what is there to be won. They don't understand the promo. They don't really know what's going on. That is why they are not really acting on it. So you need to educate them on how they can end the promo and then they will run with it. It's very, very important. So keep talking about it, keep promoting it, keep talking about it, and they are going to work on it. So that is the second week of the month. You find out this, the, the activities you started doing last week, is it working? The BUMs you did, maybe you did a conference call uh, once every week. Is it helping us ask from your team members? How many of them joined? Are their problems solved? What are the challenges we have now? Then you can draft what another record, uh, training. If your team members are not understanding authorship and they don't know how to authorship early, you do a team WhatsApp training, sermon on the page. Then you let your upline bronze or silver help you if they are available. Then it can help you on your team WhatsApp page to be able to do the training, okay? You'll be typing there to educate your team members the importance of training. Or if they don't understand your compensation plan, you'll be able to now what, do a training on it. Or it can move it to FCC or Zoom. I understand that FCC, the, 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 the free ones, the free accounts, you can only do up to 100 people. And every four minutes, it will, every 40 minutes, it will end and you have to start again. But most of the goals and above have the paid version. Some of them can take about 300, 500. My own can take more than 2,000 people because it's an enterprise pro. The enterprise accounts can take up to 1,000, but the enterprise pro can take more than 2,000. That is why we, when we do BUMs, we are able to get 1,900, 2,000 and over people joining. If it's a dollar, the announcement that we did, we did for the dollar promo like this, we got more than 2,000 people. The recognition, same as the Nigerian. So you make sure you are in line with what your team members want. If they are not able to, the, the reason why I, I, I make changes in the way we do our trainings is I listen to you guys, okay? I listen to you guys. But from 2015, I was doing FCC. That time was all new. Then 2018, I tried Zoom. Our team members didn't like it. Then I switched back to Zoom, uh, to FCC. But during the trainings, FCC, we started doing videos and we started using slides and slides and now 2020, I came back to Zoom again because pandemic is here. Many people are getting to know Zoom. Zoom was way, 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 way safer because it's not everybody that will pay to use it. And free conference call, because it's free, even though I didn't have a free account, I have a premium account. So I have extra features, more bundle, and it can, it can have extra, extra features on it, on a free conference call. But then I still found another way we moved to Zoom and then Right now, some people were also complaining, some prospects, they, they, they can't download the Zoom app. There's some people are saying, uh, they, some associates, so they say they have the Zoom, they have the FCC, they are tired, their phone, the memory is not. And I said, okay, right now, just go to the website, maxbum.life or maxmentorship.com. You are straight. Just go to the website and you are in the training. And then you will not be distracted. Some people will be on the FCC and they'll be scrolling Instagram, Facebook. They will not even be listening. Right now, you are right here and you're watching. You can't go away. That is how it is, so that we'll be able to give more value. The other thing, too, is that if you want to save your team members' content, find the best and easiest way to deliver the information to them so that it will not be... I, I realize that when we are doing training, sometimes, uh, let's say Zoom or whatever, the meeting link, it's, it's quite longer. People are not able to memorize it. Sometimes they have to click link and they get lost and all that. So that is why if we are doing the nice school, say meeting ID is just mark space. But if you are able to memorize it, Let's say you are joining a, a, a Zoom call and you have to enter a nine-digit number plus a password, all those ones. The password is there for a reason, but I take it out because I've also done some settings. Not anyone can just join and co take control of the screen, okay? If if it's, it's a public BOM that we are doing, then we can do it like that. Nobody can just join anyhow. So it's easier to now get access to trainings. It's very, very easy. So you need to let your team members know about it. Some people are not joining these trainings because they know they have to go and download an app. They have to go and, 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 and they have to get some free space on their phone. You know, all those things. So, but then again, the, downloading an app shouldn't be a, 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 an excuse. Guys, this, the world is changing you now. We are in a third world country. So we, we, we need not to conform with the things that are happening in this world. This is a, an, a country where internet is slow. Things are slow. So you need to do extract things. You need to move fast and break things before you'll be able to get your head above water. We treat internet like it is some, 
what are in a bottle when you go to the first world country they don't even think that internet is something that can finish you they all they know that wi-fi is there like ocean it's, it's just there but here they, when we are on the call like this, we are thinking how many of my two gig is left how many of my 500 megabytes is left let's move out of that COVID 19 no we need to learn from it and we need to pro 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 project ourselves outside there to be able to live to the standard. Let's not live normal lives after this COVID-19. Put yourself outside there. Put yourself, go online, learn new things. You see? Hmm. So those, those who have been joining the night school, you, 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 you attest to the fact that I've been saying all these things, okay? And then the playback of the last night school is, is on the Facebook private group. The name of the private group is Max Pays Global. You can look for it, answer a few questions to prove that you're associate, and that's all. You'll be allowed in the group by the administrators and the moderators. And then the playback is also there. You can see it. The next one will be Friday night, as usual. You see the flyer, just treat it with all seriousness. And then the private, um, the, the Telegram channel too, if you're on it, it will help you get information when it's happening when things are happening you get it straight 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 the, the, the information will be put there if it's a bm whatever because we can't have a whatsapp group that contain all of us so we need to focus and then when we are on the telegram channel just watch out if events are happening and all those things you'll be able to see it first before even it's shared on your team platform all right if you're also not subscribing to this channel please do so so that you don't miss when we are having events it's very, very, very important. Now, we've talked about the first week and the second week. Now, after 15th of the month, you need to find out from your team, take data of the team members who are still in the business, those who have not accomplished their goals. Anyone who wants to hit a rank by 15th of the month, their minimum target should be at least one third of the next target. So if they want to be bronze, their pay team should be at least 700 by 15th of the month. A minimum of 700. So you need to understand all this information, all this data, how to interpret it, what it should be, so that you'll be able to draft some promotion. So like I said, if your team is having enrollment problem, you need to draft enrollment-driven promotion with your upline, not with, by you alone. Now, how to do a promotion? The promotion has to have a time bound. You don't have to open it. Oh, uh, anyone who eat bronze, when is the deadline? When is it starting and when is it end? Don't say well, anyone hit bronze. December, they'll hit bronze and come for their food. So you need to have a time bound and a number bound. So how many people? First three people, first 10 people. Who are, is getting it? And then if they are signing three to get T-shirt, let them know, state it emphatically that this is what you get. How many people get it? So it has to be time bound. It has to be specific, realistic, and it has to be something that they can reach. You don't say uh, you are a bronze associate and you say, First person in my team who his goal this month will get iPhone 11. That's not specific and it's not realistic. You now you are bronze. The highest rank in the team is bronze. Instead of you to do prime one promo and even bronze promo, you are the first person to hit gold in your team. So you want someone to hit from senior associate boom to gold in one month and you give them iPhone 11. That's not a realistic promo. You people will get angry. They would know that you are doing promo that you think no one can win. Okay, so <laughs> let's be very deliberate about it then you have to also discuss the the promo with your team leader and the promo should have a goal there should be a goal to that promo what do you want to achieve with that promo do you want to have an enrollment new enrollment do you want to promote new enrollment or you want to motivate people to authorship early or you want to increase retention and then decrease um, 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 attrition what is the goal Okay, so then that is it. And then the 15th of the month, you monitor people's targets, how far they are, how close they are, so that you'll be able to find out what is working and what is not working, and then you can address your team by that, okay? All right, then before end of month, at the end is, and the month is ending, the, the time for you to now, if you're able to start the data from your team, you can send them WhatsApp messages, you can send them a broadcast SMS or email to notify them that the month is ending. These are the targets that are for the month to end. Uh, they, if they need any help, they should contact you. This is your phone number. If you are sending people message, they give them a reference point. What if they should call when they need some help? Okay, it's very, very, very important. Then the last day of the month to it's not the time that you call dead goats and people who have not been picking your call for ages. It's not the time that you call and check up on people that you've never called before. 
Say, boss, how are you? Your team member, you never called him before. Boss, how are you? I've noticed that you are not active. The first day of the, last, of the month to the last day, now you are calling to make sure they are active. That's not the best time to call. So call people that, so I'm not saying don't call those people that time, but call them in the beginning of the month to tell them that this month you are available for them. If they need anything to help them grow, you know that their business has been slow for now, but if they need anything to help them grow, you are available for them so that they will know that you are there for them anytime and they can always fall on you. It's very, very important. Good. Now that's the last day of the month. So you take data, inform your team members what's happening, find out who is targeting what and how close they are. So end of month, you sit by your whole house, you have your laptop, you have your book and your sheets. Who is hitting what? So you can have 10 sheets. So each person's name on it, because that is your business. So this person sitting bronze, how close is he? So you call them and you open their binary tree and you're writing things down. You take the data. This information will really benefit those who are bronze and above. So like I said, this is not really a comprehensive training. I'll, I'll touch on it a little, then we find more time to go deeply into it because there's so much that can be done at the end of the month, from the first day of the month to the end of the month and 15th. There are a lot of different things that you can actually do, the data that you extract and the data you get. And now, and now the crossover. When you're crossing over is the time before 6 p.m. 6 a.m. Ghana time. So you need to do everything at the back office. The back office will reset 6 a.m. the new month, and you will not be able to see some information, okay? Like the paid ass rank and the new active, unless maybe you go to the extra settings to now sort it out, PV minus one, minus two. Some people will not know, but those who understand will know what I'm talking about. All those things are at the back office, all right? The back office is tight, so it's not just to go and do enrollment and come and see your money, and that's all. A lot of things are there. Just go around it. Eh? You can't cause any problem. You can't delete any anything. Some people are scared that they're going to delete their money or volume. Just play around it, navigate, click, click things. It's free to do all that. All right? So the crossover time, you sit down and then extract. These are the important data you need to take. First, all the active people in your team all the new people that joined your team, all the new senior associates, so the new rank advance and the new senior associate. This is for you to be able to call them or send a message to congratulate them that you are done. And all the people who made enrollment, if there's a flyer for you to do, because at that time, there anybody, it's, it's, it's five to 10 minutes or maybe 30 minutes to the end of the time, the crossing over time that everything will reset. So that time, everything would have been done unless those who will be back dating, okay? So you can get all those data and everything accurate. It's very, very important, right? We spent a lot of time. I don't want to spend more time again. I know you've gotten a lot of value. There's so much for me to say. Like I said in the beginning, we might have to do part two next time. But I hope with this one, you've gotten so much from it, from the beginning, from all the things that we shared on the what, where, how, why, and who, all those ones. And I know that you are really going to build a long and a lasting legacy with our Max International Business. Give me some feedback if you got value from this training. Let's see. Wonderful, wonderful. I love you guys. Thank you so much for spending time with me. Every Monday night, I try as much as possible to spend time with you. I, it, this is my fifth year, five years and half, like five years and six months in my Max International business. And I try to give value, spend time with you guys and help you guys understand. I know a lot of you guys are very smart and brilliant. You just need small help, small intellectual support, and you're going to blow up. That is why we are here for you. That is why your team leaders, bronze, sofa, silver, gold, platinums, diamonds, and crowns, everybody is there for you. That's why we are doing training calls. We are doing BOMs. We are always available for you, okay? I know you are able to um, um, connect and then have fun. So when the events are happening, please share with your team. Don't be selfish and join the training alone so that you now only you will be loaded with the content and you're going to blow them. It's good that you get your teams on the, on, on, on board, they will learn. And then when you are also teaching, they can support and also help get the message delivered 
better, all right? Without much, I would love to end here. Sending you shout outs and greetings to all of you guys. I hope you are safe and I hope your family is also safe and sound. All right? And I hope you'll be able to use this information and this training that we've done today to build your Max International business. And remember, the last thing I want to leave you here with today is that don't measure your success and your progress with someone's ruler. Don't measure your success and your progress with someone else's ruler. It's very, very important. It's very, very important. So thank you guys for the feedback. You love my consistency. I'm trying hard. I'm not a perfect human being on earth. I keep learning, I keep growing so that I can be able to deliver to you. And I know that all of us are having our challenges one way or the other. People have their family issues, but at least every time there's an online event, we try, we meet here, we are able to have fun and smile together and all that. So Charlie, thank you guys. And thank you for the feedback that you had a nice time. Hope you continue to have a nice time. And always remember, don't measure your success with someone else's ruler. Don't say someone is not succeeding, so it's fine. Measure your success with your own ruler. Be better than you were yesterday. Last month, you were able to sign five. Try and then beat that record. Don't say someone signed 100. Oh, I'm not sure I can able to sign. I can be able to sign 100. Then you give up. Don't say someone signed zero. So if I have signed one, it's fine. Don't measure your success with people's rule. Measure your own success with your own ruler because you are also a child of God. Guys, thank you all so much for having time with me. I hope you got value. Have a wonderful, wonderful time. Yay! Before I forget, I forget it. Wow, announcement, sorry. Oh. Hmm. Announcement, announcement, announcement. The dollar promo. I forgot, crash. Yeah, I can't, I can't miss this. So, guys, let me show you the leak table. Crash, let's see. <laughs> let me show you the leak table, all right? Are you able to see my screen? Are you okay? Let me see. You don't see now. All right, it's up now. Good. So the Max International promo, okay? It says that if you sign one or two or three, you'll be paid. Whatever num number you sign in this business, you'll be paid. But if it's do three or four, you'll be paid an extra $25 as a promotion for this month. The only catch is that the people you are signing have to have any government ID, okay? A government ID can be their passport or uh, their student ID card or their workplace ID, their driver's license, Ghana card, voter's ID, any of those things, okay? It's very, very, very important. So that is that one. And then, so, so the promotion, the minimum you can actually earn is 2000 340. I don't know if you can see that on my screen in Ghana. See, let me take off the color. All right, 2340 Ghana cities. Because when you sign 10 people, Max International will pay you a minimum of 470 cities for, for, for the alpha stats for the 10 people. Because the minimum package is what? 49 cities, 47 cities for one person. Then you will pay 470 Ghana cities. If you sign in personal pack, you even get 1,000 Ghana cities. So that's even more than this, but we are using the minimum case scenario, all right? So the minimum is 470. If you sign premium pack, only that one alone, you get 6,000. So the minimum case scenario is 470. Now, you get prime bonus of around 140 to 200 to 315. Let's say the minimum for prime bonus, you get around 160 Ghana cities or even 150. Then the dollar promo, because you sign 10, you're able to get at least 1,500 Ghana cities. 
that's if the rate is 6.0. Even if it is 5.5 or 5.6, it will still be around 1,470 Ghana, almost 1,005, all right? Then you get a team bonus of a minimum of 210 Ghana cities. I'm saying this because if you sign in 10, five might go on pay leg, five go on left leg. That's if you don't even have a power leg, it's, it's 500, 500. That's what 210 volume, uh, 210 Ghana cities if you have only 500 volume at the end of the month. So in total, you are going to get a minimum of 2,340 on this if you are able to do that, all right? So I hope you get value and you're able to understand it. The catch is that the people you are recruiting, they need to have any ID card, any recognized institution ID card, student ID, um, bank ID, maybe they are students, they are bankers, nurses, doctor, whatever. So far, their workplace is um, recognized that they work there, license, passport, Ghana card, any ID card, okay? This shouldn't be a hustle for you. It's very, very important. Once the sign up is done, you can send it to the ambassador that's entering for you, or you, you let a person that is that you are skipping. Now, by 7th August, we had these enrollments, okay? We had these bosses. So by 7th August, we had Kenneth Ali Sugar, who was able to sign 10. That was four days ago. That was all. Benisteria had signed nine. Richmond had signed six. Gideon did six. Ibrahim, 555, and all these people, the Kayode, Epe, Frederick, Charles Bedu. So these people, many of them are from Africa, Ghana. We have Sierra Leone here. We have uh, um, Togo. We have Nigeria. So globally, right? Then today, today's promo, today's um, league table. The table has turned. A lady has shaked. The, the, the thing, hmm. Benisteria came to shake the table. She shook the table and went straight to 12. So now Benisteria is leading with 12 enrollments. Can Gali Sugar 11, Asai Nock also 10. So these people have made 10 enrollments and we are just 10th of the month. And mind you, the promo is ending 25th of August. We have 15 days. So it will end before the end of the month. We still have like five to six days before the end of month when this promo ends. So let's clock everything in. I have also targeted it like I targeted last time and I was able to get a 250. I had a budget for it. I used it for it and I was very happy. I'm trying hard. I'm working on it. I've already made my second sign up. It's level eight. So we are all working. So there are many people who have done four and three and two and one. And it will not surprise me if some of them actually climb to this ladder by Friday night school or by Monday mentorship call. It will also be displayed here, guys. So guys, that is it. And then we also launched our new commerce office last week. It's opposite the, uh, the stadium gates. Right now, Max International listening to Associates, where the old office was, it was in a place that was not really, um, it was a residential place. So Associates struggle a little, those who don't have car, Take some time for them to get there, maybe taxi and all that. So Max listened to associate. We got right in the heart of Ashanti region by the stadium, opposite, just opposite the stadium main gate. This office is here for Max International Associates. You can get there by trot trot taxi. You've been working in town, you can get there. Your customers can easily find their prospects. You can do BOMs, pick products, everything will be done there. Plus other six offices that we have here in Ghana, three offices in Nigeria and we have office in Abidjan, and we are going to open several other countries soon. Like I said, in the middle of this training, the plans that are coming up for the global extension, it's mind-blowing. So Max International Code d'Ivoire 2 is doing this promotion, all right? So if you do this package, Salgivity ATP or Salgivity Infuse, not, it, you'll not pay 88,000 uh, safer again, it's just 66,000 safer. So 20,000 safer has been taken out of it. And you know, it's a big deal. And this is a promotion for August. So, and all the new associates in Ivory Coast will also get the free branded Max International uh, 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 nose mask, okay? And this is the promo from Max International Ghana. I've already shared with you and the conditions that are attached to it. So you just have to be active by the time you qualify for the promo. 
and then you, the, the people that you are signing have to be in Ghana, and then you have to also be a Ghana associate. So they can be outside Ghana, but the account is Ghana registered account, and then you, the person signing them, have to also be a Ghana associate because it's a Ghana promo. Okay, Nigerians also have their promos that they are doing. So this is Nigeria promo. Bronzes, all new bronzes will get fifty dollars added. New silvers will get hundred dollars added. All new golds will get two hundred dollars added. New platinums will get three hundred dollars. New diamonds will get. This is aside all that they will get to as commissions, prime bonus, uh, matching check, global bonus, and max living bonus. Aside all that, this will also be given to all of them. And this one, there's no number attached to it that first three or first five. No. Unlimited. So if 100 people qualify for this, the company will give to them. As you can all see, just last June explosion from the $250, almost 100 people qualify for only the $250. That's what, more than $25,000 plus the hundreds of people who qualify for $100, $50, and $25. So company has done really well. So same in Nigeria, they are doing the free max promo for the new associates, okay? It's really, really, really nice. So guys, that is it for the promotions and the announcements. I hope you got a lot of value and you continue to learn and grow. All right? Good, 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 good. Um, you, if you want to get my mobile number, reach me on social media. It's on all my social media platforms. So on Instagram, Wapmaster. On Facebook, Wapmaster. LinkedIn, William Chima, Twitter, Webmaster. So look for me and you find me. All right. Hi, Abonti. Can't put my phone number there. My number is a special number. You can have it anytime. You can connect with any of your leaders. And then I'm sure maybe the thing that you need help with, they can even help you. Right. All the leaders that you are working with, I work with them. They are very smart. They are brilliant, they are hardworking and very successful. And they are promising future too. So I'm very confident that whatever help you need, they will be able to give it to you. So ladies and gentlemen, salute you all. Thank you so much for spending time with me today. And I know your time has not been wasted. God bless you so much. Have a wonderful evening. I love you all. Bye for now.